Today, I am going to blow your mind. This is the ultimate crafting machine that will set you back around $300, but in the end, you're gonna save so much money because you can make gifts that would have cost a huge amount more. This beauty I have here is the Cricut Maker. This is the ultimate smart cutting machine that can engrave metal, glass, cut hundreds of materials like foil, leather, fabric, vinyl, balsa, and mat board and so much more. Let's get started and dress this beauty queen up. Okay, so the first thing you want to do on your computer is to go to Google Chrome or your search engine that you prefer and you want to type in www.cricut.com backslash setup. Okay, and then what you're going to want to do is click download for Cricut Design Space and it will um, have this icon here as it uploads. Okay, and after it's done, then you want to open that. See this icon, you want to click on Applications, and then come down here and say Cricut Design Space, Install. And then it will bring this up. And then what you can do is say Product Setup, and then say Smart Cutting Machine. And then since we are doing the maker today, you want to click the maker. And then you want to fill in your information, your first name, last name, country, make sure you hit agree, your email, retype your email and your password and say create Cricut ID. Okay, then you're going to see this pop up and it just says updated policies. And then you just click accept. Okay, then it go, it's going to walk you through preparing your workspace. Um, so the first one is clear 10 inches of space, be at least behind your Cricut Maker to allow room for the um, mat to go in and out. Find an outlet. And then um, use the included USB cord to connect to the Cricut Maker um, to this specific computer. So once you have the USB cord connected to your Maker, then the continue button will turn green and highlighted so you can hit continue and everything is updated, ready to go. Then you wanna click next, then agree, and register. And you're ready to go. Um, this also comes with a free one month um, access trial um, if you wanna get that started. Um, or you can just say either start free trial or no thanks. Um, after that, it is an additional $9.99 a month. So I'm gonna click no thanks. So now we're gonna do a test cut. Um, so we're just going to select an image and click next. Okay, so now we're ready to make our first um, project. So you want to use your light grip mat and it has a film on it. So you want to take that off, but you also want to keep this to keep it clean. And um, so dust and things don't get stuck to it. Then you're going to take your um, sample paper and place it up in the corner. Press it firmly, just like in the picture. Um, and when this arrow is blinking, that means it's ready to pull your mat in. So you wanna have it up against the rollers and click this button and it will pull it in. And then it will flash the C when it's ready. So 
Okay, and then when it's finished, this button will flash again and you want to hit that. And then your um, first cut is done. So then you just slowly and gently pull off the paper. And there is your first cut. All right, so the first thing we need to do is connect our Cricut to our phone. And so I'm gonna show you how to do this. So the first thing you wanna do is you want to go to settings, and this works for an Apple or an Android. Um, and then the next thing you wanna do is go um, up to Bluetooth and make sure that Bluetooth is on. And you also wanna make sure that your Maker or Explore Air 2 or Joy, whatever device you're using is turned on. Um, and then you will be able to see um, it on the bottom here. So this one is mine, then you wanna click on that. And then it's gonna ask for the pin. And the pin is 0000, zero, zero, zero and hit pair up here and now it's saying that the maker is connected so then you want to exit your settings and go to the home button now that our Cricut is connected via Bluetooth the next thing we want to do is download the Cricut design app if you haven't already on your phone just go to the Apple or Android store and find Cricut design and this is what it looks like um, after you have the um, app downloaded, the next thing you want to do is make sure you're logged in um, and then go to YouTube. And on YouTube, when, what you're going to do is go to um, my video. And below on, um, on the bottom part of my video here is the title. If you click on this arrow, it is going to bring up the description. And below the description is going to be a link to this project. All you need to do is double click on that link and it is gonna open up the Cricut Design Space app on your phone. And it's gonna say, decorate your Cricut. If you wanna make no alterations to this, all you need to do is click make it. So now it's prompting for the first one to be um, the lettering. Um, what I would do so you don't lose and waste a whole bunch of the vinyl is I would actually, you were able to move these around. So I would click and drag and drag them um, up. So then you're not gonna have as much waste of vinyl for printing. So there's not as much of a, a gap there. All right, so then the next thing you wanna do is click continue. Now it's gonna prompt you for what materials. So if you're just using normal vinyl, then click on vinyl. Um, the iridescent um, the vinyl that I used, I would definitely click on all materials here and you can search. And I would do, um, just type in vinyl here and there's holographic sparkle vinyl but i had used premium holographic right here so i made sure that that was um highlighted for the holographic um, otherwise i just did um, normal vinyl works just fine or premium vinyl if it seems to be a little bit thicker all you do is hit the arrow button and then it's going to prompt you and have the flashing c and then it's going to show you what the next one is to print